Now, the House of Representatives Ad Hoc Committee on Gas Flaring in Nigeria from 2013 to 2023 have expressed disappointment over the attitude of international oil companies in addressing the lingering issue and effect of gas flaring in host communities in Nigeria. The chairman of the ad hoc committee, Honorable Ahmed Munir, at the resume hearing urged the uh, IOCs to provide relevant documents that will aid the committee in finding lasting solution to the lingering gas flaring by these international company, oil companies. In view of ample opportunity of time giving to both MDAs and oil and gas companies to make submissions and make appearance with a chunk of them have been responsive. As for defaulters, the committee is left with no option than to use the data at its disposal of actual gas flared and their equivalent values of recoverable penalties to be paid to the government and to recommend and submit the relevant security to relevant security institutions same for further investigation and necessary action to enforce compliance. In this regard, while I seek for your support and cooperation towards the success of this assignment, I urge you to, op to be open and honest in your presentations. The advisor, Gas Strategy Policy and Regulations, Commercial Trevor Nigeria Limited, Princess Edemu Chikuma, together with her colleague Sam Double, in their presentation says, Trevor places value on lives of Nigerians, emphasizing that gas flaring by the company has been reduced to 3% and aiming at 0% in 2024. The concern and priority for Chevron as an organization and therefore, for me or each of us here as individuals, is Nigeria. If things were different in this country, personally, I would be serving on the board or in parliament. So it's a privilege when we can serve, just to correct that impression. Not about flying first class. It's unfortunate we find a country where it is. But that said, we have on record that Chevron is one of the best companies in country. And for the question you asked about what operates in America, we have insisted, we have one of the strongest Pengasin and insisted that the policies and regulations of Nigeria be adhered to by Chevron, whether it's American or not. Present at the hearing are uh, international oil companies such as ExxonMobil, National Oil and Spill Detection and Response Agency, Chevron, Nigerian Upstream Petroleum Regulatory Commission, a regulatory body, among others. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.